Greetings everyone, welcome back to more Final Fantasy VI. Let's get some plot! Oh, you guys. What are you doing up here? In your floating fortress in the sky with your statues. Very well. <laughs> then you're just in time to perish. Behold the statues. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, I've got goosebumps. What power? Emperor Castal, please stop this madness. What? Uh, oh, Chudley, come to me, my pretty. You and Kefka were given life to serve me. It is your birthright to rule the world with me. Kill the others and we'll overlook your treachery. Take this sword. Take care of them. Immediately! Chun-Li, together thief can rule an entire world. Think of it. Power only breeds war. I wish I'd never been bored. Oh! He cut, she cut you deep! Blood? You vicious brat! I hate, 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 you! Goddesses, you were born only to fight. I implore you. Show me your power! Grrgh. I command you, give me your power! Oh, curses! Listen to me, or you'll regret it! Give me power! Kifka, stop it! Revive those statues and you'll destroy the very world we're trying to possess! Shut up! Uh oh. I think that sword hit through him over the edge. Kifka, are you nuts? Nuts? Emperor, don't disturb me! I'm showing them the meaning of power! I don't think so, friend. Your days are now over. Now relax. I'm simply going to put you to sleep with the very power you unleashed. What's so funny? Very well. It is only fitting that you go to sleep laughing. Fire sea! Huh? Flare! No! Why is it by magic working? Martin! It's supposed to be Meteor or Meteor. Well, Martin's actually something different. K Kifka! How? How are you doing this? How? Simple! I'm standing within the field of the statues. 
Their strong field absorbs all magic sent their way. Sent their way. Oh, didn't you notice? Uh, and now, statues, you've showed me a sign. It is time you show this old man your true power. No, Kefka, don't do something stupid. I command you, statues. Whoa. Incredible! Whoa! You're way off! Where are you aiming? Whoa! More to the right! Run, run! Or you'll be well done! Oh! Yes! Poor old... Oh well, what a worthless excuse of an emperor. All hail Lord Kefka. There'll be no one to worship us. Boot! Well, there goes the emperor. Step out of it, Kefka. Ow! You just stabbed me with a frickin' sword! Wait, what are you do- No! What are you doing? Oh, that's really smart, Kefka. Stripped her delicate balance. Don't go haywire! You Ninja Hanzo to the rescue. No, go. There are people counting on you. Ah! Don't worry about me! Run! I can't stop this chain reaction. I'll see you again. Count on it! You can't escape me! Woof. Get out of here on a double! Okay, I should have done this before. Crap, we're on a timer. Okay, no. Okay. Uh, where are they? Oh, there they are. No, you don't need that. You need that. Alright, let's go. Ah, jeez. A naughty. Oh, yeah, get critted. Yeah! Okay, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, 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 Whoa! Oh dear, oh! Okay, so the whole floating cut is falling apart. A naughty. I think this is the only enemy we fight up here, but... Ha! Luckily, Orbolt solves all my problems. Go, 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 go! Whoa! Jeez! I do can! That should do it! Game. This amount of battles is not satisfactory. And stop hitting Chunley all the time. Okay, I need to heal her very quickly. Oh, 
Oh boy. Okay, I am not going to the right just yet. If I do, I'll miss out on the treasure. And you get an elixir. Boss time! Narapa! Mwahaha! <laughs> you can't run! I don't know what this thing's supposed to be, but it's a pain in the rear that uses Condemned on everyone. Luckily, we have plenty of time to do this fight. Though that's burning up time. Okay, we, we get it. Suck on one of these. Hadouken! Okay, that was easy enough. I think what I want to do now, since we're not getting any experience, where is it? Okay, you're on that one. You need to get off of that. Yeah, you need to get off of that. Hey, what have you not learned? We're going to learn some magic. Because, there's such a low jump! We're going to wait. Do some more fights. Besides, we're not jumping just yet anyways. Get three magic points to fight off these guys. Heck yeah, we're gonna fight some of them. And no experience. Watch also if you go back up here says, Gotta wait for Hanzo! Which is what we're doing. We're gonna wait for him. If you jump now and don't wait for him, he don't come back. <laughs> and I mean, he's dead. He dead dead. He don't come back. You don't get him for the rest of the game. Come on. Yeah, go ahead with that. Oops. That's right, you're learning new stuff. And you... you're doing good. Okay. We'll do one more, then we'll wait. Naughty. It's rather naughty. Very nice, everyone. Very nice. Okay. Wait for Hanzo. He'll show up. And it, hey, he cuts it close, too. Let's put it that way. Right about now. There it goes. Five second mark. He shows up. Hanzo! I'll be blown to bits before I can even collect my pay. Let's go! Woo! Okay, we saved Hanzo. Oof. Can you defuse the statues? Yeah, um... Okay. Oh! What the... 
Oh! Oh! That's gonna leave a mark. Imps are falling. Mountains are crumbling. Hang on. Oh, jeez! The airship broke in half. Oh, no! Hang on to her sensor. Oh, jeez! The blackjack! Oh, nukes! Um... What the freak just happened? Oh my gosh. Okay, I think we did something stupid. Uh, we just ripped the world in half. Oh dear. Um... On that day, the world was changed forever. Woof. Yeah, I think we kind of set off a World War Three there. Oh dear. The sky is in perpetual twilight. Well, that's cool. Little house. Little island. There's a birdie. Some run down old shack. Oh. Who would that be? It said, "What you up to, old man?" Somebody's in the bed. Hey, it's Chun Li. She survived. Chun Li, at last. Chun Li, at last. You're finally awake. I feel like I've been sleeping forever. For one year, actually. I thought you were out for good. A whole year? You've watched over me the whole time? Yes, and I'm about out of energy. When your batteries need recharged or something? We're on a tiny deserted island. After the world crumbled, I awoke to find us together with a few strangers. The world. So it wasn't a dream. Where are my friends? Where's Ryu? I don't know. I only know we're here. Maybe we are the only people left alive. Since that day, the world's continued to slide into ruin. Animals and plants are dying. A few others who washed up here with us passed away of boredom and depression. Now despair. My friends, they're probably all gone. Jun Lee, you're the closest thing to family that I have. We could just live out our lives here peacefully. I suppose so, Sid. Or should I say, Granddad? May I call you that? Gramps, eh? I'm overwhelmed. All of a sudden I have a granddaughter. <laughs> My long lost granddad. <coughs> hey, are you hungry? I haven't eaten in three or so days. Ever since I became ill. What would you like? Well, unless I ask for fish, I won't get anything. That's all there is here. I'll go catch some. And now we begin a mini game. 
All right, let's uh, throw on some sprint shoes. I'm basically going to just uh, run through this. Because there really isn't a point. Birdie. But essentially, it's like every three seconds it goes by. Um, Sid will do something. Uh, I'm not long for this cruel new world. So every three seconds, he loses a hit point. Now, you gain hit points by catching fish. And usually, the faster the fish is, the more health it'll give him. Me, I really don't care which way this goes. You don't get anything but a different scene. And honestly, I think if you get the bad one... Oh, yum! Chomp munch chew. My worst nightmare is to think of you alone here on this wretched island. <laughs> so, it's kind of whatever goes. I'm just going to do this fast. If I save him, great. If not, I almost like the other thing better. So, I'm just putting on the sprint shoes to speed this up. If I save him, like I said, great. I'll try to go for saving him. Usually, the faster the fish is, the more uh, health it gives him. Okay. He's improving. It depends on his dialogue as to how much he will improve. Okay. Come on, give me some fish. I need some fish. I need some fish. Game, are you just not going to give me fish? Seriously? You're just not even going to put fish out there. Wow. They're trying to make me lose this. Oh dear. I have to talk to him. Okay, he's getting worse. It's not giving me fish. Holy crap! Okay, we're going to do this the other way. Back to here. Oh my lord! Are you freaking kidding me? Cough! <laughs> well, I can still talk. I want to thank you. Oh yeah, he's about to die. And this ain't my fault! Look at this! I'm trying to get him for the fish! Just give me something! Give me that one! Goodbye. Whoa, did I just... Is he dead? He just finally just said goodbye. Oh, yep, there it is. Granddad, you have to eat or else... What's the matter? Okay, you can see this, everyone. I got it recorded. That was not my fault. I was trying to get him just fish. Any fish. And the game went to spawn him. <laughs> Let's see if it uses sprint shoes to make it faster. Sid... Oh, this is, but this, this is a great scene here if you get this one. No! You promise you stay here with me! Granddad, answer me! Tell me you're just joking! Yeah. Those others who were here, when they were feeling down, they'd take a leap of faith from the cliffs up north. Perked them right up. Everyone's gone. Even Ryu, who promised to watch over me. The world's slowly ebbing away.
Dang. Well, game over, everyone. The world is lost, everyone's dead, and the last character, Chun Li, kills herself. Woo! We did on a high note. Wait, what? I told you, plot in this video. Birdie. Can't keep a good Magitek night now. Phew. Why did you nurse me back to health? Did I ever ask you to help me? Huh? A bandana? No, it can't be. Hey you! Where'd you get this? Is the person who healed you still alive? Answer me! He's alive. Are you still alive? Oh, we're gonna hear this tune a lot. Alright, I need to take my spring shoes off. Let's get her set up now. Mm, where's that one? There it is, amulet. Protects against zombie. I need that right now. Yeah, I'll tell you what, I'll leave the flame saber on. Couple it with a thunder blade. Magus hat. White dress. She was own seek all. Yeah, this is pretty much the theme of this part of the game. This is the part of the game that I like to sit here and call the Fallout version. It's post-apocalyptic, uh, even though it kind of won't really notice it so much. Um, and it plays a lot like a Western RPG. You kind of go anywhere and do whatever you want now. You need to leave. The others are surely waiting for you. I in the stairs next to the stove. Down them lies your free road to freedom, Granddad. Oh. Built a raft. Why did you put it down underneath everything? You just had to haul that thing up a bunch of stairs. I'll make you proud of me, Granddad. Let's roll. Now you're just gonna ride the currents to wherever they may take you. Welcome, everyone, to the world of Ruin. Next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VI, we'll explore this dangerous new area of the game and see what troubles lie afoot. Later, everyone.